Hello and welcome to Getting Started with Amazon Redshift. My name is Yuan Yu and I'm a data warehouse specialist solution architect at AWS. In this demo, I'm going to walk you through Amazon Redshift Hyperlog Log and HLL sketch and show you how to leverage this feature to speed up game analytics and similar use cases. In game analytics, daily active user is used to compare how one game is performing against itself and each other. Daily active users is the number of unique users that start at least one session in your game on any given day. Monthly active users is a similar matrix, but over a longer time period. We can compute those KPIs using players' activity logs. This looks like a simple problem, just to count distinct values. However, with hundreds of millions of game players, they could generate tens of billions player game session log every day. Compute the count of distinct elements in massive data set is a computationally intensive and time consuming. Even with well-optimized columnar format and efficient MPP query engine, process account distinct players can still take tens of seconds or even minutes if it's, long, if it's over large history data and consume lots of resources. Luckily, exact distinct player count is not necessary here. We could do approximate count which can be 2.5 times faster. The function used here called hyperlog log. Hyperlog log is a novel algorithm that efficiently estimates the approximate number of distinct values in a data set. It treats accuracy for performance, but don't be scared by the error rate. Let me show you what's the accuracy you can get from hyperlog log. This table shows daily active users for one week data. You can see the average error rate here is under 0.5%. Amazon Redshift hyperlog log capability uses bias correction and techniques and provides high accuracy with low memory footprint. The average relative error is between 0 0.01 to 0.6%. Besides the metrics for current day, KPI trending is also an important performance insight. You want to see how a game performed over time in last week, last month, or even longer history. This could mean process trillions of records to get the result. With count distinct, you always need to rescan the data set after new data added. The longer history you look back, the longer time the query takes. Amazon Redshift can extract the cardinality directly from the stored HL sketch value without accessing the underlying data set. Using HL sketches can achieve significant performance benefits for queries that compute approximate count distinct over large history data sets. HL sketch is a construct that encapsulates the information about the distinct values in the data set. You can pre aggregate the data set to create HL sketch values at the most granular grouping level and store them in a table, then draw up the distinct value for higher levels by merging the HL sketch. When new data arrives, you just need to compute HL sketch for the newly arrived data. Not only this reduces the overall computation, this is also lossless the accuracy and error rate stay the same. With the HL sketch table, we can build a game dashboard to show top game performance easily and efficiently. 
For example, we want to get both daily active user and the monthly active user to compute game thickness. With the HL sketch table, we can get this matrix very quickly by merging the just a sketch. And here you can see that the top one game here has many players, but the game thickness is only about 30%. A lot of players tried it, then quit. We can also leverage the HL sketch to get intersection count of two distinct value set. Let's check how many players played both game A and game B on a given day. Note that I estimated the total number of players by sum the two distinct count. Unlike HL sketch merge, this will incur higher error rate. Now let's drill down to a specific game to see the daily active user trend and new user acquisition trend. We can observe there was a big increase at the end of October. This is because the new release of the game includes a feature to allow players to send gifts to their friends and invite them to play the game. This helps bring a lot of new users. Besides game analytics, there are many probabilistic counting use cases, such as count the number of unique visitors for your website, count the number of distinct words in a large body of work. Leverage Redshift hyperlog log and HL sketches to handle those use cases over a massive data set, and you can enjoy the significant speed up high accuracy and low error rate. Thanks for watching.